the ignition key switch to the off position. Move the lift handle so that the locking tab clears the bracket. Use the lift handle and pull the fuel filter out of its opening. If necessary, move the fuel hose so that it clears the bracket while lifting the fuel filter. Push in on the fuel hose release tabs and disconnect the fuel hoses from the fuel filter. Place the lower hose into the hose holder to prevent it from dropping into the fuel filter hole. Remove the fuel filter from the lift handle. Install the new fuel filter so that the arrow points towards the engine. Place the lift handle onto the fuel filter. Securely connect the fuel hoses to the fuel filter with the locking hose connections. Visually inspect for fuel leakage from the fuel filter while turning the ignition key to the run position, forcing fuel into the fuel filter. Repair any fuel leaks if necessary. To finish the installation, install the fuel filter back into the opening. Position the lift handle so that the locking tab is secured under the bracket. To find out more information on changing the fuel filter on a 150 horsepower Mercury outboard, refer to a Mercury owner's manual or visit mercurymarine.com and click on the dealer locator tab.